The crisis spreads. From all over the country, unemployed veterans of World War I march on Washington, 15,000 of them. They demand immediate payment of a cash bonus promised them for the future. They need it now. They want it now. But the Senate votes no, and authorities see in the bonus marchers a mob animated by the spirit of revolution, a menace to the nation's capital. Troops disperse the veterans and burn down their shanty settlement. Out in the country, too, men are asking, what's wrong? What's happening? Farm prices have dropped disastrously, and a man's work no longer brings him a just return. The threat of foreclosure, of losing house and home, spreads through the conservative farmlands, and radical talk is boiling into action. <laughs> The Farmers' Holiday Association organizes to block the flow of farm product to the city in an attempt to force prices up. It is illegal action. But one farmer says, seems to me there was a tea party in Boston that was illegal too. Mm -hmm. 